Hi, I'm Kerry Mullen, two-time Olympian and World Cup downhill champion. I still hold the world downhill speed record in Kitzbühel for skiing 97 miles an hour, 151 kilometers an hour. I was incredibly fortunate to learn from a lot of the world's greatest trainers and top performers. And from them, I, I said, what can I take from sport and apply to business and apply to sales? I wrote a book called How to Win saying, what do we do in sport to set world records, to become the best in the world? And I want to share with you one of those principles today. It's called a process for success. When I time diarized in our sport, what we did from 6 a.m. until 9 p.m. every day, I saw we followed a process, a process for success, basically a self-improvement cycle that guaranteed better results. We spent actually 10% of our day on focusing, focusing our mind, getting ready, preparing. What's our biggest priority? Then we spent an amazing 40% on preparation, on the preparation phase, preparing our minds, preparing our bodies, preparing our equipment, getting ready to then execute. And we actually only executed 5% of our day on course, on track. Then 25% of our day assessing what worked, what didn't, what are we going to do next time to get even better. Then 20% on rejuvenation, getting ready, recovering for that next time to go through the cycle over and over again. When I look at sales and say, where are we missing or what do we need to do? We need to go through this process for sure. Focusing before we head into that meeting. What are the priorities? What are our sales targets? What's my target going into this meeting or into this presentation or for this, or for this telephone call? Then preparing, preparing our minds, visualizing, getting ready for that moment. So anticipating the questions, preparing our presentation, what we're going to say, what we're going to do. So that then when we execute, we're in the moment, we're on autopilot, we're flowing through it and we can connect and have that level of connection to be able to adapt as we're going. Then assessing. This one is often missed in sales, but the top salespeople in every organization take that time to assess, not just mentally, but I encourage you, type it out, write it down, what worked, what didn't, what are you going to do next time to get even better? And then take that little time to rejuvenate, recover, get ready for that next call. Similar to our sport, we only had 5% where we were executing. It's often that way in sales as well. We have that finite time in front of the client, belly to belly, or on the telephone, we need to go through this process so we're prepared optimally so we can execute at our best. These are some principles to take away. I wish you greater selling and greater success. I'm Kerry Mullen. Cheers.